everybody. I told you I was waiting for a special visitor and here he is. Here's Paddington. He's one of my favourite, favourite bears and he's travelled a long way. Where is it you've travelled from Paddington? Oh, he says he's travelled from darkest Peru. So I'm going to read you a story with my special guest, Paddington. And, oh, what? Yes and no. He says this one is one of his favourite, favourite stories. So I'm going to sit you there, Paddington, and we're going to read Dear Zoo. Get comfortable. Dear Zoo by Rod Campbell. I wrote to the zoo to send me a pet. They sent me a... something that's very heavy. Let's have a look. I think it is Paddington. <gasps> An elephant. He was too big. I sent him back. So they sent me a... Ooh, giraffe. He was too tall. I sent him back. What do you think's next, Paddington? Let's have a look. So they sent me a, ooh, let's have a look, something that's very fierce, a lion. I sent him back. So they sent me a, something that's too grumpy, a camel. He was too grumpy, I sent him back. So they sent me a, ooh, something that's too scary, Paddington, a snake. He was too scary. I sent him back. So they sent me a monkey. He was too naughty. Not like you, Paddington. I sent him back. So they sent me a, oh, something small. He was too jumpy. Let's see what it is. Oh, a frog. I sent him back. So they thought very hard and sent me a dog. He was perfect. I kept him. Maybe you guys have a pet at home, a dog or a cat. I don't have a pet, but I have Paddington. Yes, you can stay here for as long as you like, as long as Aunt Lucy says it's okay. So, enjoy your work on Dear Zoo this week, and I want to see all about it. Say bye, Paddington. Bye. <laughs>